In today's video, I wanna share with you five things that you need to know before you choose your Squarespace template. If you're new here, hi, I'm Louise of solopreneursidekick.com. I put out new videos every single week all about making new tech in your online business easier. So if that is something that you're interested in, definitely hit subscribe down below. So let's dive into the five things that you need to know and make sure that you stick around until the end because I'm going to be sharing with you what template I use and what template 99.9% .9 of professional Squarespace web designers use as well. Okay, so the first thing is that it doesn't matter what the template has been designed for. So for example, you're looking at the templates and you see that one is designed for a restaurant. That really doesn't matter. You can use any of the Squarespace templates for your business and you're going to customize all of that information anyways. So don't be distracted that one is a restaurant, one is a yoga studio. None of that matters because you can customize any of the templates for you. Point two is just a continuation of this, but basically you can change out all of the colors and fonts and images on your website. So just keep that in mind that you can customize any of these for your business. The third thing that you need to know is that Squarespace templates are actually grouped into template families. I definitely didn't know this when I first started, so this might be new information to you. So this is going to simplify the process of choosing your template significantly because rather than just looking at all of the templates available, you can just look at template families instead. So basically all templates within a template family have the exact same functionality. They've just been styled differently to show you different ways that you could customize your site. Squarespace has done this for you so that you can see all of the design options available, but this can be kind of confusing. So I am tackling this issue and I'm gonna be helping you choose the perfect Squarespace template for you, breaking it down by template family instead. The next thing you need to know is that they do vary pretty heavily in flexibility. So that's why I'm creating this new Squarespace template series so that I can break it down for you um, and show you exactly what you can do with every single template family. Squarespace does have a template comparison chart that breaks this all down for you, but I don't know about you, when I see a chart like that, my eyes would just like glaze over and I'm like, mm. So <laughs> instead, I'm gonna be creating some videos for you that show you, you know, what all these features mean exactly. So I'm gonna be compiling all of this information into one epic blog post. So definitely click the link in the description below and you'll see it as I start to post all of the videos and materials. I'm going to be showing you all of the templates that are in each template family and just overall try and make this process as easy as possible for you. However, as I mentioned, I wanted to share with you the template that I use and the template that 99.9% .9 of all professional Squarespace web designers use, and that is Brine or any template within the Brine family. These templates are just the best. They are the most flexible and customizable. So that's the one I use and you'll find everybody else seems to agree with that as well. So again, click the link below this video. It'll lead you to the blog post. And for now, I'm going to share with you all of the templates that are within the Brian family. So you can go and check those out. And then you might be wondering, okay, well, how do I choose out of the template family? What I recommend is that you choose the one where you like the fonts the best. I find that font pairings are the most difficult for non-designers to tackle. So instead, I get my students in Website That Wows to just choose their template within the Brian family and choose the one that has the fonts that they love the most. This saves them from a lot of difficult design decisions and ensures that their site looks significantly more professional than someone that didn't have any guidance in this area. So yeah, definitely click below to check that out. And I'm going to also be releasing all of these Squarespace template review videos. So definitely subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss those. And if you have any questions at all about this, let me know in the comments and I'll see you guys soon with another video.